Hello guys! Well, first of all, I want to apologize for the horrible noise there is today in my building, which you can't hear just right now, but don't worry, it will, it will start again. I don't know, there are always, always people working in the building, like, just like destroying it, considering the noise, and I don't know why, but it's just horrible, so please, please excuse me for that, I can't do anything about it. So, I wanted to talk to, to you about my hair, because some of you have uh, asked about it. Uh, like, sorry, I'm, I can't breathe. What happened? Oh, it's this noise. <laughs> well, some of you have asked uh, what I do for my hair, which products I use, etc, etc. So, I thought I would make a very, very quick video, because actually I don't do anything for my hair. Oh, here it is. So pleasant, isn't it? Oh God, I hate you guys. Well, not you, the, the, the workers. <laughs> well, I don't do anything for my hairs actually, uh, apart from dyeing them every, mo every month because I have, because, because, oh God, because I have white hair. I have them since I'm 35, I think. So I used to dye them every month for years. Uh, it doesn't. It, it doesn't bother me because uh, it's okay. I go to my favorite hairdresser just at maybe 20 meters from my apartment, and we we have nice chat each time. Uh, it's really nice. I I like this. It's not a problem for me to go there, and, and it's not expensive in his place because it's a small small hairdresser. So, so uh, right now I have nothing in my hair because I was at the hairdresser this morning. So I thought I would show you how they look when they are not like glued by the, the hair gel because I try to grow them well it's not I try I grow them even if it's very very long because if you can see the length here no you don't see it let's do it this way if you can see the length here this has not been cut since mm, November 2012 I think and in November 2012, it was like one or two centimeters long. So it was not cut at all. We cut it, we cut just here in the neck because it's horrible when it grows, you know, it's just like disgusting. So we have to cut for it to look like something. And right now they are okay because I just go out from the hairdresser, but oh, they are so, so straight and fine. And, if I don't do anything for them, they will just go like, I would say this way, maybe, which is not what I want. <laughs> and that's why, and, I, and, and plus, I can't stand to have even one hair in my face. It drives me crazy, really crazy. That's why I, at home, if I have no gel, I wear a headband. Because I can't stand to have even one hair in my face. So I glue them with hair gel because uh, it maintains them in place and I think it it makes like a little like I've done something so what do I use for my hair I, I use two products that's all I use this shampoo which is the Ducre extra doux for delicate hair my hair is not delicate but it's a shampoo you can use every day and it's a 400 milliliters bottle so you have for a lot of time so I, I normally use this one and nothing else and no conditioner nothing I don't need anything in my hair I, I mean they are very fine and thin but they are okay apart from that they're okay I have no problem and I don't need anything in them I never blow dry them uh, uh, apart if I'm really really late or something like this but I mean I have a blow dryer but I use it maybe twice a year and uh, because I have time for, for them to dry naturally, so I let them in the morning, I wash them, I wash them every morning because I, I like to, it, they don't need to be washed every day of course, but uh, I like this. I don't feel clean in the morning in my shower if I don't wash my hair, so I do it. And then I uh, dry them in a towel, you know, and I brush them with a regular brush like this. I tried the Tangle Teaser, it doesn't work on, on me, it breaks uh, as many hair as this one. So I think it's not made for me, but it's okay, it doesn't break so much hair, even if they are wet. And then I put this, this headband in it for them to dry this way, and not this way, 
because I don't want to have them in my face. And then I just wait. And I go on my blog and reply to the to the comments and I reply to my mails and etc. And why they are dr drying in just naturally in the air. And then I put this gel on them to glue them, which is a L'Oreal one. I, I've been using it for years. It's the, one of the more, it's a gel extreme, which means extreme. It's one of the more um, strong that I find, that I've found. I, it really, it's really, really strong. It's just like, I always say it's like I have a, an iron cask on my head. It's not a cask, it's... What is this name for it? Well, you know, something you put on your head to, to, to drive a motorcycle, this kind of thing. So I always say I have this on my head because it's, it's almost like iron or something. No, I exaggerate, of course, but it's very, very strong. And like this, they don't move for all day. I'm quiet, it's okay, they won't, do, they won't go anywhere. And that's it. That's all I do for my hair. So I'm, trying, I'm, I'm growing them, actually. I want them to be at least long like this, or well, at least shorter length, it would be nice. And then I will see what I will do with them, but I think I won't, I won't do anything special. I will just leave them like this with long layers and that's all, because it's what, is, what I like for long hair. And I will see if I can't stand to have them long and fine, because I have, I have God, this is this is hard today. I don't know. Maybe it's the noise, or I don't know. I, I can't talk. <laughs> um, I have had them long years ago, of course, and I know I, I was not very satisfied because they are not very. They are nice, but they are so thin. So I don't know. I'll see once they will be long, like in ten years, <laughs> how they will look, how I like it. Um, if I don't like it, I will come back to my very very short ones. So that's it. I. I th thought it could be interesting for you to share this because I'm so not an American woman considering my hair and so not even an English one because they use lots of products, they do tons of stuff for their hair, they style it, they brush it, they dry it, they do tons of things and I do nothing because I don't feel like it, I'm, I'm not very interested in this kind of things so yeah my point of view is very very different and I think it's it's a little bit representative of the French woman. I'm not saying that all French women think like me and feel like me about their hair, of course, but I think that we are very much more effortless for the hair than American or English girl, for instance, because those ones spend a lot of time on their hair, and lots of French girls are very, very natural and don't do anything. So, I hope it replies to your questions and it's a little bit interesting for you. And, uh, well, I'll see you soon. Bye.